Gee, what do you think? suppose old Oracle is on about? I don't know. Sounds like pretty heavy stuff. Yeah, not sure what to make of it. Dark spirits? Never heard of such a thing. Right here and happy, happy? How does he come up with this stuff? Oh, excuse me, kind sir. We're poor wayfaring refugees from the next forest over. Forest fire. It engulfed everything. The flames came crashing through our home. Oh, my poor little family and I just made it to the water pool before the flames engulfed us all. Now, we are just looking for a home. Oh, please, kind sir, can you take us in? We don't take up much space. We don't eat much. You won't notice us for years. Maybe that's what Old Oracle was on about, a forest fire. Oh, that's really scary. We could end up being just like those poor refugees. Nothing to eat and nowhere to go. My pappy always used to say, the forest is big enough for any critter willing to put up with the boredom of being here. Yeah, it's pretty boring sometimes. Oh, perhaps we can help a little bit with that. No, no, don't listen to her. She is putting you on. If you take her in, our forest will be in danger. She is not as innocent and helpless as she says. Don't do it. Don't do it. Listen to the voice of wisdom. Gee, she sure seems honest and sincere enough. Yeah. A poor little thing. A poor little thing. Oh, thank you, ma'am. It's nice to know that there are still caring critters left in this world. Don't fall for that line. Our forests will never be the same. They are bark eaters. Bark Don't eaters. you know what that means? No, what does it mean? Dead trees. No, no more forest home. Oh. Taking her in seems the noble thing to do. We can't just leave them to starve. No. I guess we best do it. Everything is for the best, isn't it? I don't know, is it? Oh, thank you, kind critters. We'll keep to ourselves and not bother anybody. Ah, oh, all is lost. Our forest is dead.